one topic remains, a kind of specialized limit finding technique for quotients involving square roots. It's a little hard to state exactly when you use this technique. It's a kind of know it when you see it type of thing, but you're taking a limit of a quotient and either the numerator or the denominator has a square root and it has addition and subtraction. And you've got a quotient, as I say, but you can't take the limit using the quotient rule. You get a division by zero error if you would try. So something like this. We've got the square root with subtraction in the numerator, and we've got a quotient, but if we try to use the quotient rule, like so, it doesn't work. You get a division by zero error. We have a special trick for dealing with this, which you may recognize if you've rationalized fractions before or divided complex numbers, let's say. We're going to multiply this fraction by one, but we're going to write one in a very special way. What we are going to do, let me first copy this down. What we're going to do, you see I said we should have subtraction or addition. We're going to take that and we're going to change it. So we have subtraction I'm going to now write that same square root and this three, but with addition connecting them instead. And I'm going to divide that by itself. So this is one, we're taking this fraction, we're multiplying it by one, we're not changing the fraction. And what does this do? Well, the square root of x minus three times the square root of x plus three is x minus nine. And in the denominator, we also have an x minus nine. And these can't so, and you get the limit as x approaches nine over this. And now when we use our limit rules, we no longer get a division by zero error. The limit of a quotient is the quotient of the limits. The limit of one is one. The limit of a sum is the sum of the limit. 
Yes. The limit of a square root is the square root of the limits. The limit of this constant is the constant. And finally, the limit as x approaches 9 of x is simple. Nine. The square root of nine is three. Three plus three is six.